Oh. All right, oh, so I'm with Adam, and we're going to go over uh, shadows overnight, words of dismay. I think it's really at a very good place. I would say just glow, <laughs> which has been the word of the day. Um, and also, I would say let's, let's actually give it a little bit more space to actually live. So I'm going to hit C for right. drop, and then hold down Shift and Option on my Mac, and then I'm going to get more space, OK? Um, then I'm going to, it says missing link object because you didn't give me the, the object inside of your folder. I'm going to just say rasterize because otherwise it doesn't know what to do. Um, I'm just going to command C these. This is just the white space command to apply. So that should be it. Okay. Yeah. All right. Um, deeper brush just to get off the top tool. Is this like clear all the way through if we were to? Or is that white on top? Your text is not. So basically, so basically, the um, three layers above it are basically being uh, the texture of it. So they're kind of just textured images that are placed and um, uh, placed over it with like design styles. Mm -hmm. I want to get the text. So maybe you made this an illustrator and not here. Basically, I want to grab the text. So I grab the magic wand tool, I'm going to uncheck contiguous, I'm going to hold down shift and click this H, and I should now get all of the text. Command uh, H to hide the dancing ants, because I don't want to see them. I'm going to make a new layer, and I'm going to fill it with white, just so that I have some text that I can mess with. Okay, so I Go have for a flat, okay? So I'm going to, I have a new layer. Um, G is the shortcut for dump in Photoshop. Now I'm just yep. going to dump it. If I dump it with the blue, which I don't want to <laughs> be. Um, D for default colors, X to switch it, white to dump it. And I know that's not going to be a perfect text, but it's going to give me a, a, something that I can use for glowing, which then I can turn the thing clear. Okay. So basically now I'm going to hit command and select it, which I've done. And I'm going to. You can do a knockout, I think, in the um, in in the Photoshop layer style. So maybe I won't delete the white yet. So I'm gonna just Command D, I guess, right now. I've got this text that's sitting there as white. It's hard to see it, but it's in this layer. So now, layer style. Did you do this in Illustrator, anyways, already? Uh, the vector, the. Smart object was in um, Illustrator. Um, the the whole speckle thing was in Photoshop. Okay, so I'm going to take the spread and the size of this down. Just to, I want glowing. We're talking about nighttime, so mm -hmm. uh, we're getting there. I'm starting to see some stuff, but now the size is too big. There we go, a little bit. I think what I want to try to do is set up a mood board so that I can actually get a visual color um, for it. That's why it's still black and white. Mm -hmm. so. Okay, so I've got that. And then I'm going to paint some blue specialness on the inside. So let me try this. Mm. Um, so I, this is my text stuff. So this is uh, text flats. And I'm just going to call them flats because they're not truly the true text. Um, uh -huh. So now I'm going to hit B for brush and I'm going to grab, let's try that special brush that I just showed you, the um, Magic Arc one, and try it not with white, but let's try it with a purpley blue. It's a little bit different than the um, green blue that I have there. And let's see, ooh, goodness gracious. <laughs> um, because it's too big. Bonk, 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 bonk. Smaller with my brackets. See what happens when I paint in here. You're not in paint. Nothing. What just happened? I'm in yes, inside you're... the world because it is right. Let me out of here. Cancel. There you go. Did I jump onto a different layer that was? You might have just jumped into the uh, the smart object. Yeah, I got into it, didn't I? Hmm. That's great. I want to have a new layer that's like. I'm gonna paint it above it all because I'm yeah, like, dude, that, but, that's what's um, happening. That other stuff was affecting it too much. I want to let um, this stuff live on the bottom, um, and I want it to be 
inside that flat because right now it's not. So I'm going to command click. Now I have that selection. I'm going to come back up here, command A to hide the dancing ants. I'm going to call this FX. And I'm going to paint. Like this is where your night happens, where everything's special. Maybe there's shadows, horrors. Maybe this is red down here. Oh no. Scary, right? I'd like to make the night noise effects because I think it makes sense. <laughs> it's horror. I don't know. It has to be scary somehow. Oh, All yeah. of this, just like... and especially as a graphic designer, I want you to be aware that you should always be checking these things and view through setup, full blindness, there's no view. Can I still see it? I can still see it. It's working. So now I'm going to go back. View through setup. Monitor RGB is for the Mac people. Yeah, okay. my goodness, that is such a good like tool in Photoshop. And then let's go back down to here and give this whole thing a big old outer glow. And I don't think white is really going to be your background color. It's not. It's just there to you know. There to there. be a flashlight in my eyeballs, so I can't see the logo. So command <laughs> here, and we're going to darken it because it's dark. Oh, I've got it, that selection. Command D to deselect, Command U to bring up the hue set. Now I'm going to darken it <laughs> so much better, even with all the sparkles. Hey, um, now it's night. Real quick, mm -hmm. um, can you take those three, uh, uh, just the layer three copies and three uh, layer three, and Alt put that uh, into the vector smart object so that it doesn't showcase that. <laughs> So it doesn't showcase it. You don't want it. I love no, it. No, I mean like the the hard edges. It's 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 an image. So oh, that, it would just. I'm not just done. I'm not finished. I'm not creating finished stuff. You know how to delete those lines. I agree. They have to go. Um. But so yes, you're gonna delete these lines. But you would just do that with an eraser, and you can go and get them. Um. But I'm there's three of them. You'll have to go and get them. It'll take a little bit of time. But this is so much more a story than what you have. So I want you to think about story. The story happens because I said things like night and scary, like words as adjectives pushing this idea. Okay? Sure. All right. I'm loving it. I love the way it's going. I'm going to save these files and put them back on the Google Drive for you all, but you can do this all yourself too. Um, so. Oh, Jalen needs back in. I'm going to let him back in. And uh, so.